Hello everyone, how are you all? I am sure you all are enjoying this festive season which is going on. So happy Navratri to all of us. And apart from that, it's a Sunday. So I am sure you all are having a great day with your friends and family. Now, this video is going to be very important for all of you. And those who have written me, ma'am, how to introduce ourselves. I will explain you exactly how to answer this question, which looks very simple, isn't it? That introduce yourself, isn't it? Simple question. But we do struggle to answer about ourselves that how should we introduce ourselves. So in this video, I will exactly give you constructive answers that what not to include in your introduction, what to include, what more to add on and what not to add on. So continue watching until end. So if some of you already went for interview of this uh, Indigo or Spice Jet or Vistara, you may be aware that how they ask questions, especially in the first round, they ask four or five people together, actually more than eight people also. So sometimes they call eight people together inside room and they ask one simple question which can be even introduce yourself and why you want to be cabin crew. And now the thing is you are eight people, you need to create that impression on them because they have an option. Clearly you can see that, that they have a lot of options. And now it's our chance to put value in our answer and answer as per their expectation remember guys which interview you are going for if you are going for cabin crew interview of course you need to know that it's a service industry and your introduction should be circulating around that industry so what i mean if you are fresher if you are experienced how to introduce i'll tell you first talk about yourself like for example, good morning everyone. This is very important if you see interviewer, they are not only single person, they are two, three people first of all. So greet everyone, not like good morning, good morning, good morning, not that way. Just quick eye contact to everyone, including the people who are with you for the interview. How do we do that? Good morning everyone, like this, in a quick glance. Then move on with that energy. My name is Reema. I am from India. If you are going for some international airline interview, of course, you don't have to say India. You can say Delhi or wherever you are from. Or after that, talk about your experience first. Rather than your education, I would recommend if you have an experience like me, where I come from Qatar Airways flight supervisor, then I had a Kingfisher experience and before that I had hotel industry experience as well. So rather than talking about my qualification, I would talk my experience first. So experienced people, this is my personal advice, experience first. Why? Because people there, those they are listening, they are actually initially they are connected to you they are listening to you carefully so grab that attention their attention is very much needed in the beginning so the moment you told your name where are you from talk about your experience that will make me as a recruiter interested in you okay you come from same background you have a similar experience so you are more suitable people for me or more suitable candidate for me so that is why I always recommend talk about your experience first. Now, do freshers, I will talk about it. Just give me a moment. Let me finish with the experience people first. Don't worry, I will cover you also. So experience first cannot be just I am working in a Qatar Airways as flight supervisor from nine years. No, I want you to add more about your experience like my responsibilities where i am responsible for making sure where i'm making sure that i am guiding and assisting my crew member coaching them on board also as a supervisor this is my responsibility to make sure that standards and procedure which is high standards and procedure which is made by qatar airways has been maintained on board after that my major responsibility i feel that i need to take care of my customer and every single individual passenger those they board in my flight i make sure that they are leaving that aircraft happily how do i do that by making sure that service recovery has been done properly so this i will make sure that i'm 
answering it i am adding it in my experience rather than just men mentioning about name of the organization and the number of years i am working there so please do that guys if you are experienced find some kind of positive thing in your work for example if you work in a industry which has where you are involved with people maybe through emails through conversation through phone add that thing do not just let it skip talk about every single important thing which you have it in your experience highlight it make sure maybe for you it's a small thing you do it on a daily basis so maybe you are not finding it that interesting but remember recruiter are watching you and they are looking for those kind of answer so emphasize on the area which you all ready good at in your experience now talking about freshers if you are fresher of course after your introduction you do not have work experience what you will do don't worry talk about your education first rather than your family background talk about your education talk about whatever you are doing currently where you are going and how do you, how what education you are doing now i am sure in college you participate in lot of activities where people are involved where team is involved so make sure that you highlight one of those kind of activity which you participated in maybe for example if you participated in um, dance competition or maybe some politicians uh, activity which goes on make sure that you highlight one of those point why i am saying that choose point which is appropriate for aviation industry where people are involved where team work is involved some kind of activity where you were working with team involving with people make sure that you choose that one and highlight it during your strength or during your uh, hobbies somewhere you need to focus on that area and tell them because you need to grab their attention that okay i am the best candidate for you doesn't matter even if i am a, not experience in the same field but i do have a similar kind of experience and you know more than that i am perfect suitable guy or girl for this job which is cabin crew job or maybe ground staff now moving on after your experience talk about your education now for the experience cabin crew you can talk about your education and after your education end it by choosing the best appropriate strength why i am saying best appropriate we do have lot of strengths right as a person individual person everyone have different strength तो आपको जो लगता है कि ये मेरा परफेक्ट स्ट्रेंथ है जो कि मैं यहाँ पे हाईलाइट कर सकती हूँ फॉर एग्जाम्पल इन माई सिचुएशन मैं बहुत इंटरक्टिव हूँ आई रियली लाइक इट आफ्टर टेन ईयर्स ऑफ एक्सपीरियंस इन एविएशन एंड होटल लाइन एक्चुअली दैट इज नॉट जॉब फॉर मी दैट वॉज माई नेचर दैट वॉज माई इंटरेस्ट ऑलरेडी आई वॉज इंटरेस्टेड बिफोर बिकमिंग होटेलियर और बिफोर बिकमिंग कैबिन क्रो तो ये मेरा एक स्ट्रेंथ है आई कैन टॉक आई कैन हेल्प पीपल तो मैं उसको जरूर हाईलाइट करूंगी इंटरव्यूअर के सामने बिकॉज वो एक ऐसा स्ट्रेंथ है जो कि इस प्रोफाइल के लिए डेफिनेटली उनको जानना जरूरी है और उनको मेरे को लेंगे वो उसके बेसिस पे नाउ you can end up by saying that in my free time i love to read book or whatever you really love or you whatever you like to travel for example these are also suitable hobbies of that job now even if you mention that you sing you sing a song and all make sure that you are ready with the cross question thing they might ask you okay so what is the book you are reading right now be ready with few names so do not just flaunt it for impression if you really reading some kind of book then only mention that your hobby include reading and all otherwise just go for the option be genuine to yourself this is your self introduction do not just copy paste from somewhere prepare for yourself you can remember the sequence which i said and according to that prepare proper self introduction and practice looking in mirror now for the people those they want me to train you personally i do have a coaching classes where i train personally and in batches please make sure you send me email at this mentioned id which is reema.sharma89@gmail.com 
this is for the people those they really want me to personally check them and understand the area they need to work on and according to that i will give you feedback and prepare you for the next interview bye bye guys i hope this video was useful and you liked it bye guys